Welcome back to video number two of eight. This is the dresser drawer series video, uh, drawer number one. So let's get to the second row. The last video, you saw the cars in the first row and a few cars that were on the top. So let's check out the second row. So we have Back to the Future DeLorean time machine. So uh, I'm not sure exactly how many they have made of this car, but they've made like four different versions of this car so far, I think, somewhere in there. And this, I believe, was one of the first ones. So there's that one. Let's see, the second car this is the Footloose. Volkswagen Beetle, which is super cool. I have not opened one of these yet. I have not opened a bunch of these yet. Uh, I have bought extras of certain cars. They may be in a different box, but you may see duplicates in this box too, so, or in this drawer. Let's look at the next one. This is the old Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Little 84 Pontiac Fiero. This is really cool casting. I actually haven't seen them come out with this casting in a while. Wouldn't mind having a red one with a, the big spoiler on the back. I had an 88 Pontiac Fiero. It was a four cylinder, but it had the big wing on the back and it had cutouts for dual exhaust, but it only had single exhaust on it. I don't know why they had it cut out for dual exhaust. I guess it, in case you wanted to convert it over or whatever. I don't know what the deal was with that. But it was the 88 was the last year they made this car. And that's the version that I had. I owned it for a few years. Really a cool car. So let's see. This one is a, one of the favorites of mine. A-Team. Custom GMC panel van. So this one, if you can see it, it's actually got gray paint on the top and black on the bottom with the red separating them. The gray is kind of hard to see, I guess, a little bit. It's really a cool GMC van, man. I've got, I do have one of these opened up. I did buy an extra one for sure of that and already opened the set it free, so see what we got here. This is Knight Rider. This is Car. So I should have looked it up before I showed the video because I forgot what Car stood for. But I'm fixing to go pause the video and then unpause it and tell you what it stands for. So I'm back. So I googled it real quick. Car Knight Rider. Here we go. There it is. It is the name of a fictional automated prototype vehicle featured as a major antagonist of Kit. In two episodes of the television series Knight Rider and was part of a multi-episode story arc in the 2008 revived series. So it stands for Knight Automated Roving Robot. If you can see that right there. Boom. So that was car. I have the kit also. And if you guys, well, we'll come back to kit later on. The kit was the uh, Knight Industries 2000. That's what the kit stood for. This, this was like kits, uh, whatever nemesis or whatever you want to call it. And we have Smokey and the Bandit, 77 Pontiac Firebird. I'd like to do a comparison of this one versus the brand new uh, Fast and Furious Trans Am. Which, let me pause and we'll look at difference real quick. Alright, so I did some digging just real quick. This is Smokey and the Bandit's Retro Entertainment car and it does have the date 2012 on there well here 
is the Fast and Furious Trans Am, but it's the same casting 77 Pontiac Firebird TA Trans Am. So here's the difference they are both metal bodies, metal bases, real rider tires on both, but this one's a little different. So there's a bunch of glare that you can look at real quick. You have that one, kind of hard to see, and you have this one. So I actually like the rims on this one better than those rims. So but let's look at the tail lights. They kind of they kind of kept it going the same. They both have the uh, Trans Am bird on them. It's actually bigger on this one. It's pretty small on the side of this one. I don't know if you can see that. It's pretty big on that one. Anyways, yeah, they're both 77. So, anyways, pretty cool. I do like this one better. And this one is a brand new one that just came out. This one should show a 2000, okay, 2017 date on it, which is weird because it just came out 2019. So there's that. Let me put that down over there. And stick this back in here somehow. And let's pull out this. Haha, <laughs> check this out. Oh, Boulevard series. This is the uh, Ford Bronco 85. So this was a sweet one to get. This one did come from, oh man, I forget. It was like a, I don't remember where it came from actually. I think it came from either Tuesday morning store or, man, what's the other name of that store? May have come from a Tuesday morning store. Oh, look. Okay. Well, let me pull that back out. Okay, well. Okay, the bottom two were something different. It's the Boulevard series. This is the old Jeep Cherokee or Jeep Wagoneer. Okay, it's not Cherokee. Reminds me of a Cherokee. This one's a sweet ride too. And so pay attention, to, or, or I keep saying pay attention. Be sure to uh, come in on the third video of this series because I have more of these apparently and they're in the third row there so I'm not going to pull them out now. And uh, we'll see what they are. Anyways, this was a fun series back in the day to try to find and, uh, so that's pretty cool. Here's what you, there's what you would have found if you had found the whole series. 88 Jeep Wagoneer Porsche 993 GT2, 85 Ford Bronco, 63 Corvette, and the Corvette C6R. So hopefully we'll have some of these other ones to show you in the video. So stay tuned. Thank you for watching, and have an awesome day. Bye for now.